previously. We just want to talk to this guy. He knows. Bullshit! My way! No, 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 please, please. No. Clementine? Pigeon Gang the Flyer, suck my beef! What's up with y'all? Y'all already know who it is. Who the fuck is this? <laughs> oh, you stop doing that shit! It's your boy Andy, you heard? And today I'm feeling a little pretty, I'm not gonna lie. But listen, last Walking Dead episode, I gave y'all part one. It was 30 minutes long, but that was a month ago. I apologize. I feel like I'm gonna be starting a lot of these videos with. I apologize. But I'm here to bring y'all part two and episode five within the same week. I know I'll be capping a lot, I know I'll be lying. It's because I don't get around to it and that's my bad. But I'm gonna start holding down my promises. I'm not gonna be lying to y'all, I swear. Thank you guys for 10.7K and all the support on the videos. Y'all already know that shit makes my heart. But hey, without further ado, let's get right into it. Pigeon gang and no gang. Please don't hurt him. What did you? I'm smacking the literal shit out of Ben when I see him. You're not from Crawford. Who's you? You're not the guy on the radio. Why would I I'm tell not her a that? guy at all. Full marks for observation. Why would I say that? That was the dumbest shit I've ever... Put the gun down, Kenny. Kenny, don't! Oh, oh my god. No, he's with us! Who the hell are you people? Who is this, Hillary Clinton? The name's Molly. Well, she get I'm crazy late. top. This is Kenny and Clementine. We're not looking for any trouble. If I name Molly, she get crazy top. What the hell happened to you? You sure you want to know? Hell yeah. Put us on. I know gang wants to know. When that everything meal. started going to some people got together and sealed off that whole neighborhood. Folks willing to do anything to stay alive. Stop the dead getting in. I try to avoid them. Why? Let's just say they have a zero-tolerance policy for anyone who won't, or can't, live by their rules. So how'd you know we weren't them? Because there are no children in Crawford. Not anymore. What happened to them? What do you mean, no children? Why not? No children, no elderly, no one with an advanced medical condition. Basically, no one who might be a burden on the community. Ah. Uh. Crawford's all about the survival of the fittest. That's how they survive. All the rest of the world went to shit around them. What exactly did Crawford do with all these burdens? What happened to them? Well, you met some of them already. Oh, that's Fuck. some nasty shit. Anyone who got sick, anyone too old, anyone they figured wasn't strong enough to survive. To them, those people were just mouths to feed. A drain on their precious resources. This whole episode is twisted. Every what the hell are you doing here? How'd you get out of the house? Well, Meat started getting really sick. Kristen and Ben had to take him upstairs. Oh. I didn't just want to sit around there. I wanted to come help. I told you we didn't need any help. Oh, Misha got infected. Really? Because if it weren't for her showing up when she did, I would have beaten your brains out. That's debatable. Uh-huh. Oh, nice. Okay, my boy Lee flirting. Do you know who's been ringing those bells all over town? Yeah, that would be me. I knew it. Lee, I knew she was the one who's been following us. Fucking with us. Get that finger out of my face, Grandpa, before I Ooh. get straight up your ass. Ooh. I haven't been following you. I don't even know who the hell you people are. Calm down, Kenny. The voice on the radio was a guy, remember? Yeah, well, whoever you are, ringing those bells this morning nearly got us all killed. Raise the dead all around us. That's the idea, genius. It's how I get around. I ring a bell in one neighborhood to attract the local geeks towards it. Buys me some time to scavenge the areas they cleared out. Ah. Isn't there another way back to the house? Mom, is there a Dude, I was just about to say there's an alleyway right there. Damn. Spider-Man. Hey, you just gonna leave us here? Sorry, I must have missed that part of our conversation where you became my problem. Don't leave us here, please. Come on, make it fast. Clementine just blessed. She's so adorable, she got us out. Hurry up, Lee. There you go. Lee, get your ass up. Bro, just jump over the dumpster. You're telling me you're not athletic enough to jump over that shit. Oh, hell no. Nah, fuck it. We're gonna meet some Ninja Turtles tonight, bitch. Use that to pry it open. We good, Clem. We good. I'm alive. We chilling. 
Yo, watch out before they fall on you, gang. <laughs> Donatello. Yo, don't slip. Oh, I. <laughs> my ears burn. That's a drainage pipe. Yo, we playing Where's My Water, y'all. We're gonna get we're gonna get the water to the alligator. Yo, who got chewed up over here? Oh. <gasps> oh. Uh, must have tried to hide out down here. He was like a father figure to me. Damn, that made hella noise. I don't know why I did that. Nope. Nope. Get up there, get up there, get up there, climb up, climb up. Learn how to improvise. Oh, wait. What the hell? We got a secret hideout. Oh, it's lit. Oh, we didn't even got a flash. Yo, turn your iPhone flash on. Definitely nobody down here. If all that shit is here. Man, what the fuck? Hey! Are you? So my name's Lee. It's all right. It's okay. Look, I'm sorry I disturbed you folks. I'll just be going. You can't let him leave. He's from Crawford. If he goes back there and they find out we're down here. Are you from Crawford? They don't lie to me. I'm not from around here. I'm from Athens. Grew up in Macon. I have a brother in Macon. You were there? How was it? As bad as here? Yeah, type shit. I'm sorry. It's all right. It's okay. Vernon, what the hell are you doing? He knows. He's trusting me. He Vernon! Relax. I'm not here to hurt you. How did you find your way down here? My group and I were up by the river looking for a boat. Just tell him the now truth. I just want to get out of here and find him again. Well, that sewer system you came through runs all over the city. It'll take you wherever you want to go. That group has medical supplies. What kind of medical supplies? I don't know. All kinds. I'm sure there's something you could use. Vern, we need medicine. Joyce is in a lot of pain. I can't bear to see her like this. Maybe it's worth the risk. Maybe so. This is where I started feeling kind of bad because I just lied straight to their face and told them we had medical supplies. We're knowing damn well we do not. Clementine? Clem? Lee, thank God you're back. Krista, what's wrong? It's Omid. He's gotten worse. Nah. Who's this? This is Vernon. He's a doctor. Oh, thank God. Could you take a look at him? I'll need to see those medical supplies. What medical supplies? Yeah, I don't know what he's talking about. He probably has dementia or something. Sorry, Doc. Had to get you on board somehow. Well, you just get better and better, don't you? I'll see what I can do. Take me to him. Nah, he a real one, bro. He's gonna save my boy Mark even after I lied to him. All right, let's take a look at him. I work yeah. better without an audience. I'm sure you have more things of your own to attend to. He be I. Just give him a little kiss. He'll wake up. Clementine. Clementine? Yo, y'all left her behind, yo? Yo, what y'all did with Clementine, yo? Clementine, if you're playing hide and seek, I'll count to ten. If you're not, whooping that ass. Where's I'm... Clementine? Don't ask me. I'm not her keeper. Do I look like I'm in the mood to be jerked around? Hey, yo! Last I saw, she was downstairs with your redneck friend and that college kid who hangs around with him. All right. This maze ass house, he was dumb big. Two bedrooms, wait, the, so the two bedrooms connect to each other and the bathroom and the hallway can, that's some weird ass shit. Yo, what kind of layouts? I told Clementine to stay put. What else could I do? Don't be sorry. Just tell me where the hell she is now. Like what? Shaggy. I think she went out to play in the backyard? On her own, with no one watching her? Clementine? Clementine! She not even out here. You lied to me, bitch. What were you doing in there? What were you doing in there? Exploring and look, look what I found. Oh my god, Clementine, you fucking just lucked out. Holy oh, shit, holy swear. shit indeed. I'm sorry. Oh, he sobered up. He already knows what's going on. Look at this bitch. Bro, your forehead about big as mine. I'll smack that shit. We should go back out on the street, see what we can find. That's not gonna work. Crawford took everything and brought it inside their walls. They siphoned Damn. every gas tank, stripped every battery. There's nothing left out there. You saw that for yourselves. Sounds like they'd have everything we need. Maybe we should try there. I know the sewer system that runs beneath Crawford like the back of my hand. We come up right underneath them, take them by surprise, grab what we need, and get out before they even knew what hit them. Dan, are we seriously talking about this? I mean, what about the risk? 
Always bad vibes from Ben, yo. Give you all a chance to prepare. I'll be back before midnight. Be careful. That's how I'm still alive. <laughs> My dog G. Is it going to be dangerous? It's what gonna be dangerous? Crawford. He has a dangerous ass crossover, but I don't know about uh Y'all got me fucked up with these choices. Like I was avoiding going into Crawford. No Jamal. Fuck. Fuck. Do you think they saw us? They definitely heard us. I don't think though. I don't think so. I don't think they saw us. I think us, we're though. good. For now at least. What the hell happened here? I thought this place was supposed to be secure. As long as we don't let them box us in, we can still do this. The plan hasn't changed. The plan hasn't changed? Every time walkers show up, the plan changes. Do God. you have any idea how many of them are out there? Ben and Molly on the same boat. I do not like Come on. Ben or Molly. I'm sorry. I mean, we just met Molly. We're going to give her a chance. I got a bad feeling about this. <laughs> like, bro, when are you going to fill on some bitches? Okay, students. Today, we're going to be learning about quantum physics. We bought four professors from the University of Big Old Booty Boys. Give it up for Professor Don Telbius. <laughs> Thank you, thank you, thank you. As you can see, I have two degrees. You could get like me too. All you gotta do is follow me on Instagram and DM me about my online trading course. I will put you on to real sales. We got fuel, we got the battery. Hey, how'd you guys make out? We got the fuel. Awesome. Good job, guys. Shit. <laughs> what the fuck? Kristen Vernon must be trapped in there. Fuck it. Woo! Woo! Sharpshooter, pussy. I'm from New York City. Oh. What the hell? Oh, I happened? thought I thought that was someone else. They wandered into the hallway after we got inside. I think they must have heard us rooting around in here. The whole place is infested. They're everywhere. Calm down. I took care of them. What about the mids? Did we find what we need? Yeah, that's our other problem. Take a look. They're lying. They're over here fucking. Looks like they were keeping all the prescription meds in that safe. Locked up tight. There's no way we can bust it open? What do you mean by that? Boys. Okay, you get started. I'll take a look around, see if I can find anything useful. Yo, Lee is always taking a look around. Medical file? Anna Correa. She must have been a patient here. And what's this? Ooh. I could do this too. I was gonna play uh, a... Krista, come look at this. I was gonna play a cassette tape on a TV. Since the outbreak. Really? 1547, Dr. Logan in consultation with patient Anna Correa. Huh? Why are you recording this? Regulations. Oberson has ordered me to keep records of all medical examinations and consultations. Mm -hmm. I need you to brace yourself, Anna. The sonogram confirms that you're pregnant. What? Oh, God, oh, God, oh, God. As you know, the rules are very clear. The termination is mandatory. You don't have to tell them. Tell them it was just nausea. But oh. you gave me something for it and it went away. This is my problem, not yours. If Oberson finds out that I concealed evidence of a pregnancy, I'm sorry, but these are the rules. I'm gonna give you a sedative. It'll make the procedure easier on you. I don't want the procedure. I want oh, my the numbers. baby. The I numbers. can't do this. I can't do this. Anna, you don't have a choice. Now, if you like, you can take some time with this. But I need you to come back no later than tomorrow. Or I'll have no choice but to inform Oberson myself. Oh, they're going to kill I'm that sorry. shit. They're going to kill the baby. Damn. Open this shit. Let me, let me get the code, Bozo. Damn it, we almost had it. What the hell kind of place was this? Like Molly said, the worst kind. Lee, maybe there's another tape. We gotta keep looking. I think I recognize that doctor. He was one of the walkers out in the alley by the auto shop. Maybe you should search it, see what he's got on him. Some good shit. Have you made a decision? I thought you said I didn't have a choice. Well, technically you do. You can terminate the pregnancy or leave Crawford. A 
course, that would be a death sentence for both you and your unborn child. God. Maybe that's best. I stayed up all last night thinking about this. Why are we even trying to survive? To keep on living? If this is what it takes. If this is what it's turned us into. Sure, I'm right, fucking. Rules, Hannah. Doctor, I'm begging you. Please help me. Maybe one day when things are different, you can try again. But for now, today, we have to do this. God. Oh, good shit, shorty. No. No. Oh, she poked him. Where you go? Where you thought you was going? Oh, on the floor, pussy. She poked the shit out of him. I think we know what happened to Crawford. She's More importantly, we got the combination. <sighs> That's crazy. Christa, are you all right? What's wrong? It's nothing. That was just hard to watch. Don't worry about me. I'm fine. Tape number three. I don't even know there's a third tape. Whoa. Whoa! Molly! The last I can give you. Why? Overson had someone down here yesterday taking inventory. <laughs> He's really cracking down. I just can't risk it. We had a deal. Yes, we had a deal. We don't anymore. Well, I knew I knew she was part of this, but I didn't know she was the Crawford tree. Yo, she was probably throwing ass to everybody for supplies. Yo, let's hit her. No. Oh my god. <laughs> that Loki scared me. <laughs> okay, Molly. Lee, shoot this fucker. I got you. Nice shot. Thank me later. Come I got on. you. Man, what the fuck Ben was just standing there? What the fuck is going on? on? They're coming. Oh shit. That ought to hold them. Sir, but now how do we get out? Through the armory. We can just get this damn door open. Come on, damn you! This is my fault, all my fault. What the hell's he babbling about? Ben, we talked about this. No, wait. I want to know what he meant. What do you mean this is all your fault? Penny, I'm so sorry. I'm so sorry, man. Kid, this ain't the best time. Whatever you did, save it for later. I opened the door. I let them in. I said save it for after we get out of here. Fuck. Go ahead. Tell them. It's been me all along. Putting all of us in danger. Katja and Duck. It was all me. It was all me. Wait a minute. What are you saying? Oh, it fuck. was me who made the deal with the bandits at the motor inn, slipping them supplies. I thought maybe I could keep them off our backs. When it got discovered, that's when they attacked. And that's when Duck... I, I feel you, Kenny. I feel you, Kenny. Kenny, man, I agree with you. You should kick his ass. But now's not the time. You gotta focus on getting out of here. You little pisshead! You're fucking dead, you hear me? Dead! My wife and child! You gotta both fucking kill! Kenny, listen to me. Fuck. You can whip his skinny little ass later. But right now, we gotta go! Nice group you got here. Not the time, Molly. If this asshole thinks he's getting on my boat after what he did, he's out of his motherfucking mind! Kenny, we'll sort this out later. After we get out of here, okay? We literally. We gotta get out of here. Out. I just told you the way it's gonna be. The boat's not big enough for all of us. Somebody's gotta get left behind. Might as well be this piece of shit right here! Well, I vote we leave him. I'm sorry, Ben. I know you mean well. But all I want to do is get back to Omi. Damn. I, I don't know what to say. I I I I can't even. the rest of us? Don't we get a say? God. Now can we go? Damn right. Vernon, come on. She was so calm about that. She was getting ripped apart, and she was just so calm about it. What you like, lady? Come on. There's got to be a way out down here. Oh, close that shit, close that shit! That's not gonna hold. Back upstairs! Lee, look! Ooh! 
Oh yeah, this shit. Double barrel, pussy. Oh no, nah, let me shoot. Bitch, back up. You thought you was crazy? Target practice, bitch. Boop. What up? Oh god, rusty ass. Shit, shit. Take that shit out, take that. Oh fuck. Take that shit out, take that shit out. Take that shit out. Let's get it, we out. We just saved our life. Was that Ben? Was that Ben with the crispy aim? I still don't fuck with him. Woo! Bye bye! Bye bye! Come on, let's go! Ben, we out! There's always some shit with Ben. Oh! I don't know. I've got you. Ben, you're not worth all of this effort, bro. Come on, you can do it. There's no time. You have to go now. Oh. Come on. Let go, damn it. Get the others out of here. Please. Oh, we don't I don't want to do this. We, we both know. He, he's a piece of shit. He's a piece of shit, but I don't want to not like that, bro. Not like that, bro. Not like that, bro. Wait, no, what the fuck? I clicked. I clicked. Put. Oh. That's not even how I wanted him to die, bro. Like, I wanted to shoot him myself. Clementine? Clementine! Where's the group? The entire group? Oh, God. oh fucking A. Uh, Clem! No way, Clem is here. I knew it. I knew there was going to be a zombie here. Bitch, don't ever run up on me like that. Oh, there's blood on her hat. Oh shit. No. What's that? No. 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 Wait, what? What? You out here? Did he just get? Are you crazy? What are you doing out here? It ain't safe. He got bit. Clementine, whose blood is that? No, Lee. Oh my god. No, no, no fucking way. There's no time to worry about me. Clementine's gone. There's no chance she just wandered off on her own? Then who the hell took her? I don't know. Last night Vernon came to me and offered to take her with him. Said she'd be better off. Son of a bitch. I knew we couldn't trust that fucker. Wherever she is, I have to find her. Okay. What do you need from us? Clem may not have much time. We have a better chance of finding her if we all go together. Shh. Who's with me? We're all responsible for Clementine. And in your condition, you may not make it to her in time. She needs our help. All of our help. Damn right. We can't let you do this alone. Oh, meet him. Settle down. We'll look for Clementine together. Hell yeah. What are we waiting for? Thanks, you guys. I appreciate it. Oh, my God. God. Oh my god, Lee, no, bro, Lee. You've always been there for me, Lee. Always had my back when it mattered. What kind of friend would I be if I wasn't there for you now? Bitten or not, I'm with you to the end. You can count on me. Okay, guys, we should go find Vernon, see if he took her. Let's head out. What about the boat? We just gonna leave it unguarded? If someone was gonna take it, they'd have done it already. Besides, what choice do we have? Yeah, we taking Clementine back, bitch. 
ran off. I really hope they didn't have Clementine, cause the fuck out of here. Vernon, get out here! There doesn't have to be any trouble here. All I want is the girl. Give her back and nobody needs to get hurt. Yeah, he is not here, bro. Clementine, oh! Are, are you alright? Where are you? Vernon, you son of a bitch! Holy... The dude from the train! Who is this? It's not Vernon, if that's what you're thinking. Clementine's fine. But if I were you, 